more things change, the more they stay the same. Boundaries shift, new players step in, but power always finds a place to rest its head. We fought and bled alongside the Russians. We should have known they'd hate us for it. History is written by the victor, and here I am thinking we'd won. But you bring down one enemy and they find someone even worse to replace him. Locations change. The rationale, the objective. Yesterday's enemies are today's recruits. Train them to fight alongside you and pray they don't eventually decide to hate you for it too. Same shit, different day. You know what I'm looking for, Sergeant Foley. Keep your eyes open. Got a new batch hitting the pit today, sir. I'll send you the best I find. Welcome to Pull the Trigger 101. Private Allen here is going to do a quick weapons demonstration to show you locals how it's done. No offense, but I see a lot of you guys firing from the hip and spraying bullets all over the range. You don't end up hitting the damn thing and it makes you look like an ass. Private Allen, show them what I'm talking about. Grab that weapon off the table and fire at the targets behind you. Turn around and fire at the targets. See what I mean? He sprayed bullets all over the damn place. You've got to pick your targets by aiming deliberately down your sights from a stable stance. Private Allen, show our friends here how the Rangers take down the target. Crouch first, then aim down your sight at the target. Allen, adopt the crouching stance and aim down your sights. That's all there is to it. You want your targets to go down, you gotta aim down your sight. Now, if your target is behind light cover, remember that certain weapons can penetrate and hit your target. The private here will demonstrate. Last but not least, you need to know how to toss a frag grenade. Private Allen. Pick up some frag grenades from the table. Toss the grenade down the range to take out several targets at once. Frags tend to roll on sloped surfaces, so think twice before tossing one up here. All right. Thanks for the help, Private Allen. Now get over to the pit. General Shepard wants to see you run the course. All right. Who wants to go first? Show me what you've learned so far. Private, welcome back to the pit. Heard General Shepard wants to pull a shooter from our unit for some special op. Anyway, he's up there in observation. Okay, good, so you already got your sidearm. Do me a favor, try switching to your sidearm. You see how fast that was? Remember, switching to your pistol is always faster than reloading. Well, smile for the cameras and don't miss. Shepard's gonna be watching. The best shooter gets to join the prima donna squad. That's your thing. Okay, head on in. Timer starts as soon as the first target pops. 
I don't know why they don't put us in first, Alan. Very much the Rangers can't do that SF and Delta can, but whatever, man. That's so calm brass for you. And all those freaking blocking positions? When are we gonna see some real action instead of babysitting SEALs and D-boys, who are? Timer starts as soon as the first target pops. I don't know why they don't put us in first, Alan. Very much the Rangers can't do that SF and Delta can, but whatever. That's so calm brass for you. And all those freaking blocking positions? When are we gonna see some real action instead of babysitting SEALs and D-boys, who are? Yeah, it was all right, I guess. You need some serious polish, though. Okay, head upstairs to regroup with your team where you can go back in and run the course again. We 
are the most powerful military force in the history of man. Every fight is our fight. Because what happens over here matters over there. We don't get to sit one out. Learning to use the tools of modern warfare is the difference between the prospering of your people and utter destruction. We can't give you freedom, but we can give you the know-how to acquire it. And that, my friends, is worth more than a whole army base of steel. Sure, it matters who's got the biggest stick, but it matters a hell of a lot more who's swinging it. This is a time for heroes, a time for legends. History is written by the victors. Let's get to work.